the guy parked in the car right next to me is eating a whole pie with his hands. I've never been more envious of an individual as I am right in this moment. Thank goodness it's Friday because I'm bloody tired. I haven't slept well in three nights, which brings me to today's discussion. Being tired is not a competition. There's not a trophy for the person who is the most tired. So it drives me insane when I see these memes, mems, whatever the frig they're called, going on about how I used to think I was tired and then I had children. Yeah, I get it. Having children is exhausting. Having a newborn is exhausting. I don't understand that exhaustion. 100%. That doesn't mean that I can't be tired right now. About the same as saying, unless you've gone a week without food, you can't ever say that you're hungry. There are lots of people who don't have children who have experienced exhaustion. Paramedics, doctors, nurses, military personnel, People who have been traveling in storms and whatnot for days without sleep. A million other reasons that people could be tired that have nothing to do with having children. I'm not negating how exhausting it must be to be a parent. I'm just saying, even if you do not have children, you are allowed to say that you are tired. I think that is a big problem in today's society is that we are proud of people who are so busy all of the time and they're so tired. They're so tired because they're so busy. And then at the same time, people are having so many cases of adrenal fatigue and hormone imbalances and all sorts of things to do with not getting enough sleep. And then you have people on social media sharing these things saying that unless you have this certain circumstance, you can't actually be tired, which just perpetuates the whole situation. Everybody is allowed to be tired. I can be tired at the same time you can be tired. We can be tired for two different reasons. You might be more tired than me, but that doesn't mean that I'm not allowed to be tired because I am. I'm a fitness instructor and I have fibromyalgia. Either one of those things allows me to say that I'm tired. One of the reasons I don't have children is because I'm already exhausted. If I don't get eight or nine hours of sleep, I turn into a pumpkin, like a legit hump on the couch, just this little ball curled up in a blanket because I cannot do anything. <laughs> you should be able to say that you're tired, even if that means you need a 20 minute nap, or if that means you need to actually sleep for 46 hours straight and rip Van Winkle style. Stop trying to make it a competition, people. If somebody tells you that they are tired, just say, you know what, I feel you, it sucks to be tired. Or, you know what, I'm tired too. You don't need to say, oh, you think you're tired? Why are you tired? As if they have never done anything that could be tiresome. Studies are now showing that doing something like computer programming is as exhausting on the body as weight training. So even though I say I'm a fitness instructor and that is part of the reason I'm tired, which it is, but that doesn't mean that someone who works at a desk job is going to be less tired than me. Honestly, I think they're probably more tired because they're sitting at a flipping desk all day long. And that is what I have to say today. If you're watching on Facebook, be sure to like, comment, whatever, so that more of my stuff shows up in your feed. If you're watching on YouTube, like or comment, and you can subscribe if you want to get notifications whenever my new videos go up. I'll talk to you guys next week.